Hi. I would like to talk to you about something that's on my mind. Just thinking about, um, about par parents, um, who are, who are, um, in, a, in an abusive relationship with, um, lovers, um, marital partners, uh, they're, uh, <coughs> And it, and what why they can't leave um, leave those people uh, for the sake of their children who who may end up also being abused. I mean, and uh, just thinking about thinking about um, this uh, this, um, this re reason why um, unabusive parents can't can't leave um, their abusive partners behind for the sake of their, their children and and what I would call the um, the love trap I mean because um, I mean so I mean so so those parents just um, just still love their um, abusive partners and they just um, they just don't don't want to leave them for some, for some reason or another. It is like they're so they're so um, addicted to their lo love for their partner, and it's like uh, they just they just can't see a life apart from from them. I, mean, I know that it's talk about it can also be referred to as dependencies, like like. Maybe, maybe that um, abusive partner is uh, the sole provider for uh, for the family, and that uh, that if, that if the unabusive partner leaves, um, then then she, then she, she, I mean, mo mo most commonly it would be a she. Um, what what basically have to fend for themselves. Uh, to f find a job and uh, support support their uh, children in, in case the word they're going to have to uh, have to leave leave such such um, ab abu abusive partners. I mean, and of, and of course there's also there, there's also the fear of leaving because. I mean, uh, because the, I mean, those um, abusive partners have, have such a tight controlling uh, grip on on the unabusive partners that uh, uh, they just uh, they just like the, just that these unabusive partners can't can't, can't see, see themselves living apart from them. It's, like things like there, there's this case of like the battered wife syndrome, like like uh, that that these unabusive partners are also abused themselves by by their partners. I mean, I, mean, I know I'm talking I'm I'm basically talking about both. Uh, uh, both domestic abuse and child abuse, and in these same uh, in, in in the same discussion here, because uh, where, where rarely do do we see uh, where rarely do we see um, domestic abusers of being being different apart from child abusers. I mean. I mean, I mean, being be, being in a, being in an abusive relationship. I mean, re really damages um, people. I mean, because uh, like children who grow up in like abusive homes, they they may find themselves in abusive relationships of their own. If if not as the abuser, then uh, 
as one being abused by by um, people who just uh, will will end up abusing them, basically because they just can't seem to find anything better th than th than one who abuses them. It's, this this is something what what Mike Winger calls uh, love confusion. I mean that these um, that the that these abusers um, show show some some sort of affection tor towards their uh, tor towards the un unabusive um, partner and and uh, just uh, it's like I mean I mean it's a relationship that has the feelings of love, but it doesn't have the qualities of love, I mean, as Mike Moyer would say. Just, uh, I mean, I mean, child abusers, um, really, really need to be st stayed away from, um, at all costs, and, and, And pa parents who really care for their children, uh, who are who aren't abusers themselves, must put their children first above above their um, own partner's needs because uh, because the, I mean if they I mean if they don't pr protect their children, they're they're going to be seen as n n nothing more than accomplices of abu abusers themselves. Just like they, they they did nothing to pr protect their children from the abuse, they're they're just as guilty. I mean, and and there there are there are some um, par parents who are willing to die die for their uh, significant other that that that's doing the abuse, uh, or rather than uh, stand up for their children. Uh, who need to be protected from the abuser. I mean, and this is something that um, needs to be pr prayed about. Um, that uh, that abused people would um, come out of those relationships, and uh, that God God would protect them and keep them safe. And uh, I mean, and. It'll be hard because um, because the, the abuse of partner may may may, um, may be possessive to the point where um, they can't live without the uh, their their partners and and I mean like they just feel this uh, attachment and. Just, this possessiveness, like, uh, it is, I mean, like, like they're just bonded to each other. But it's something, it's something we need to pray about that, that, that would sever the ties between, uh, abusive par partners and, uh, I mean, be, the, from, from the unabusive partners and, and make sure that the children are protected from from abusive parents, because uh, God help God help th those who um, won't won't stand for their children. Anyway, that's pretty much all I have to share with you in this video. So have a good day, and may God bless you.